Brewarrina has had a complex history. We've, uh, for such a small community, we've had two Royal Commissions, multiple Ombudsman reports, public inquiries. We've been a leader in dropping off the edge data and twice identified as the state's most disadvantaged community. That all started a change in 2016, however, with the Land Council creating uh, really strong Indigenous leadership, connecting all community groups with governance at the base of that model. So this collective that we have, you know, we're making really good decisions about the community in terms of governing our own language, governing our own culture, and also looking and maintaining our significant sites that are so significant to us. Cultural preservation of our land and our environment is the first priority of business for our local Aboriginal Land Council. That sets the platform for very strong governance. These lands that we have in hand back to us are going to be crucial in reintroducing our, our younger generation to their culture and how important it is. We've got to not put ourselves first, but put the future for our kids first. We know what this fight is. We're going to continue this fight. That's why the Bawarana Local Aboriginal Land Council is important, because us Riverbank Blacks, we're going forward.